Hopefully this is the last time then. Hmm. Hello and welcome to the Volvo Plays What Is To Be Air, the Ost Enders speedrun. This is one of the few achievements where you can use custom nations. And we are going to be doing so to connect Austria across to Bengal much, much more quickly than is otherwise possible. That little custom nation that we've just made there, we're going to be able to... They're small enough in war score that they're going to be able to be vassalized, and they own a bit of Bengal. So as long as we vassalize them and then integrate them, we'll get the bit of Bengal we need. We give their king crappy, crappy traits so that they can't find friends, and so that they fight like garbage. That'll do. We make sure that they are Austrian culture so that we can annex them more quickly when we do go to annex them. We make sure that they are Catholic for two reasons. One, the same thing about um, annexing them more quickly. And two, to, um, to make sure that it's harder for them to get alliances. Not just the bubbling buffoon, but that. It needs to be under 200 points worth of custom nation, and it is. So we say done, and then we go Austria, play, Iron Man, do, and it would be an achievement that we can get. Whew. Now, we know the start, we've got a no CB you, then no CB him. In that precise order, because otherwise people like protecting you, Wallachia. Ready, steady, cook. You, be my friend, wait a day. You, be my friend. Excellent. I need you to be willing to give me access. We should go check out if Poland's willing to be our friend as well. He is not, so we're going to need access through you. And you. Generate some money out of thin air. Get rid of the horses. They're a waste of cash. That'll do. Yes, I'll ally you. We. He has no friends. No one is protecting him. Good day to you. I need access through you. Uh, sure, I don't mind calling you to... Well, actually, I do mind calling you to arms until I get your capital. Yes, yes. Very good. All of you head here. And then we do this guy. And I don't care that you're allied to Albania. Albania sucks. <laughs> okay, now we've got to start getting our stab back. gonna say teleport in a leader, but alas no. Now that we're sitting on the capital, we could call you in, but it's a bit late. No, 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 no. Just get access through here. Nicely. Leave my... Boo! Forming up stacks alone. You jerk. Okay.
looks pretty good. Still need more units though. Can't, can't cancel their access partway through and expect me not to get it back. What an asshole. Okay, that is you out. Goodbye, Skanderbeg. Thank you. God. Tooth and nail. Now, I need my access through you. that, you go fix that. And then he explodes, and he is no more a problem. Good. You trade for this. He goes out and starts working over here. You seem to imagine I care, HRE. I do not. Dev this up. I need more cash. Thank you. That will do nicely. Remember to turn that off. Stab back to zero. Or at least back towards zero. I should be improving with a Pope to make him happy. That is no longer needed. We could be auto-upping with our friends. I don't need this fort. Merge. Minimize costs. And then come back here. Okay, you need to head towards... That isn't necessarily terrible, as long as I still get this and can vassalize him. And as long as they haven't eaten the Bengal bit. Don't you dare. He wants to. Tough. It's my minion. Live with it. I make him happy enough that I can steal this. Core it. Good.
The champion of the joust. This man shall lead our armies. Kill them. Okay, see if he changes his mind. Very good. So he's now my little minion. And we know that he does own this. Perfect. In fact, if anything, that's extra good. Because the, um, the Timurids eating these bits means he won't cost as much to annex. So now we just sit around, make sure he's ready to annex. Annex him. And save up 2,000 ducats for building the stupid buildings in, um... The stupid buildings in Bengal. In the TC zone. Now, admittedly, he's very unhappy with me for, you know, aggressively expanding, for vassalizing him by force, for being at war with him, but he'll get over it. You can start training. How can we help him get over it? We could help him get over it by putting a... I was going to say a merchant over here, but I can't yet. I need to wait for this core to finish so that I have... Uh, better trade range and stuff. I could also yoink this from him. But no, that would be a terrible mistake because then I couldn't annex him. I, I need him to have that core. I no longer need all the accesses we used to have. That's true. Get rid of this one. What other access do I have that I don't need? Serbia. The rest of this is fine. Might as well up with this guy as well. Stab back up. Then peasant war can't trigger. Stability is one or more, so... We recover our manpower. We want you. You're going to help us annex our enemies. Well, our enemies. Our minion. Don't need this on anymore. That said, one more bit of money wouldn't hurt. And then we'll say no more. Pope loves us. Beautiful. More Pope points. In fact, even more Pope points, please. If you could give us some soldiers, that would be helpful. It's not like I need trust with him when he's as likely as not to become our um, PU for free. I don't care about the autonomy here, so it can have its autonomy. Bavarians are all at war with each other. No, it looks like Ingolstadt got PU'd for free. Ingolstadt start with the uh, pretty old old ruler, and they tend to get PU'd for free by land shit. The decline of Hungary. Gain a restoration of the Union CB. We'll see if he becomes our bitch for free. But uh, honestly, doing anything that isn't just waiting and annexing this is a waste of time. What else could we do? Could I concentrate your dev? No. Then I think the only other useful thing we can do is try and get extra poke points to enhance our... <laughs> 
speed of annexation with the Pope Point reward for annexation speed and uh, dip rep, which is also annexation speed. Annexation speed and cost. I have two subjects, so we should quack, 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 quack. Strong duckies. Use the emote if you got it. Strong duckies. I do want that. I want the other happiness one. I wouldn't mind some extra mill points. I wouldn't mind some bird points. I wouldn't mind them being happier. I wouldn't mind them being happier because I have some boats. I wouldn't mind some admin points, but we don't have enough crown land, so we go mission yoink. And then we fight them. I have to beg for access, we will. Get prestige back. Easy done. Just pass some art funding. Prestige comes back. And that's enough to do that. Beg you for funding. Kill off the bad guys. Beg you for access as well. Go kill the bad guys. Quack, 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 quack. Yes, Obsidian Doggo. That and then there. Yep, and then back over here, and rest. Uh, let's concentrate your dev, because why not? I don't care if you're disloyal or not. His loyalty doesn't matter, the only loyalty that matters is the other guy. If I really have to, I'll give him up as a subject. I have the thing that I need here that lets me border the our subject so that I can annex him. I might actually want to flip to this guy. He is half price, so okay, you know what, we'll flip to him. This helps make this guy happier so that we can be absolutely sure that when by the time the, the 10 years is up, we can annex him. When is the 10 years up? Seven more years. We have seven years to get 180 improved relations. We can get 80 from more improved, like, direct sucking up with our diplomat. But the other 80, I can get 50 by influence and gift, and then the rest of that should decay away and we're fine. Mm. Burgundy would even... He would even let us uh, maybe get our chance at the Burgundian Inheritance, so why not? Do that, that's going to stop him wanting to attack into the Empire. <laughs> or at least to attack me. He might still want to attack uh, Lorraine. <laughs> Train. Mm. Apparently my walk outside has... Triggered my allergies a bit. Now, you. Are you going to accidentally murder Ladislaus? Or are you going to be a good and loyal hungry? And what are the two buildings I actually eventually need to build in this guy? Because I wasn't actually paying attention to that. Owns a province in West Bengal area with the District Trade Company Investment and with the Military Administration Trade Company Investment. Oh, 
he's been naughty. Well, you know what? You've just forfeited your right to be my friend. I hope everyone takes a nibble out of you in the meantime. Are there any Games of Thrones that we could win? Offaly? Leinster? Silly? No, no one worth winning. Sorry, but no, that money is mine. We need to have another baby. And I suppose we could work on making the electors happy. So like Saxony, you're already probably happy, but we'll make you even happier. More Pope Points, absolutely. It doesn't look like we're going to have enough Pope Points by the time the, the uh, we're allowed to annex. No, no one gets access. You all suck. Why do you think I'd give you access? You suck, Ottomans. I suppose Timurids can suck as well. And Poland, if they hate me, I'll hate them. So 10 a year, we've got 4 years, that puts us at 50, I am going to need to influence and gift. Mm, yes, turn off joint offensive war seems reasonable. Don't want to get distracted, reasonable suggestion. Thank you chat. Same with the Pope. You all suck, you're only here to help defend me. We've had that baby. And what a baby! Five, four, five. Yeah, but if I really, really was worried, I could just go spend down my trust. Hunting accident incoming. Three times more here. No more times there. We hadn't been allied long enough there. So one. Yeah, there's Castile. Meow, 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 meow. You're not joining my wars. Fine. Two. I can at least do one more here. <laughs> and twice here. Looks like Moldavia chose to be a strong, independent Moldavia. Who don't need no Poland or Hungary. How did you get that one? He's taken the... No, he got permaclaims, surely. Maybe he has the claim adjacent to claim power? 
Because I thought these were permaclaims. Lalakia is being sassy? Yeah, they are. If we really cared, we could go and improve with him. Now that we've had our baby, people are doing what they're supposed to again, mostly. So there's no further improving you. We could further improve this guy. And then we'll have three of the votes. Manpower. Uh, it's time for us to go sit on that. But you hate me now. That's awkward. I'm going to have to build units inside Wallachia. Okay, inside my other guy. To fix that up. I'm surprised Poland hasn't made a move here. What a strong independent... Yeah, they are. If we really cared, we could bring some fraction of these around by boat. Stop needing to hire so many. Something like that. Have people seen sense? Are they willing to vote the way they're supposed to? No. Uh, Bohemia is trying to steal it. I don't care about Milan. And we don't really care about you either. Wait, what? Ugh, you're just making the problem with... with them worse. Okay, these can come back home. I don't really need to be paying for my capital. Hey, Pisces Freak. Oh, sorry, not capital. Paying for our forts at the moment. What else is going on? Why are we suddenly making less money? Is it that these are reinforcing? Doesn't look like that it's them. How's our voting going? He's about to swap, so we've got two versus two, so we're winning. Can we just loan up for the TC stuff? We totally can. <laughs> totally can. What month next year? 
is the uh, ability to integrate August. So T minus one year. At the start of this next year, we bribe him and we bribe him. We make sure that we've re-raised the maximum amount before then. And we've got you on so much lockdown that we don't really care about anything else. I don't need to be training, which means I don't need to be paying for my army. Get rid of that. Two more months. Hmm. December. One more month. I then call back from here. Influence gift. Come on, there's none of them. No, you're going to say not enough morale. Fine. There's nothing stopping us from doing some more of this. Kill off this. Minimize reinforcement costs. Can I afford to divert his trade? I totally can. That's more opinion. Now we can turn that back off. Okay. Exploit money. There. That's going to be enough to send him his gift. Done. He's ready to annex. How do you defeat Mamluks as the Timurids? It's the third campaign now that I get wrecked by them or the Ottomans. The Ottomans you usually try and gut by... I mean, if you're, if you're anywhere in here and you have boats, you take... You take Byzantium and stop them Stop them getting Byzantium. Without Byzantium, it locks off one third of their mission tree. They don't get lots of lots of free claims everywhere because of it. They don't get the instant upgrade to an empire rank, so they don't get instant acceptance on all of the other um, sister cultures. It's, it's a huge blow to them to not own Byzantium. Boop. None of this to do. How quickly is this going to get done? 63. And the Pope almost owes me enough uh, Pope points to let me speed that up. Also, we should swap over to the Speedy Uppy Guy instead of Everyone Loves Us Man. Speedy Uppy Guy done. Pope, owe me more favours. There was an ad break. If you're anyone over here and you can, you cripple them by doing the Ottomans. By You cripple the Ottomans by stealing biz before they get to get it. Mams? The Mams don't usually become that much of a threat. Um, like, I don't know why you're... You shouldn't be having too much trouble with the Mamluks as, as Timmy. No, I don't want your cash. What I do want is to click this. Thank you, Pope. Now I need 2k. Yes, once you get past the um, starting ruler stuff, uh, which my suggestion is go the Icta thing that minimizes uh, subjects unhappiness, get the dip rep guy, uh, do some dev in your subjects, it really doesn't matter because you have cores on them anyway, so you annex them for free. Normally you don't like doing dev in your subjects because it means that, yoink, it means that 
it makes them more expensive to annex, but in your case, it doesn't matter because you already have the cores. So when you go to annex them, you just slurp them up for free. Um, and the other thing is try and eat eat up a jam as much as you can of your cores back before the before your ruler dies. Uh, I also suggest yoinking the land from Sistan. You can steal his other province or provinces, um, but for the last bit, for his last, his capital, just abandon him as a subject. It's not worth it for one three dev um, subject, and it makes all the other subjects a lot happier about relative strength because there's four less um, army strength on their side. So those would be my, my starting as Timurids thing. See you, Tarkus. Suboptimal? Hey, there's probably a whole bunch of things, but uh, this this here is peak performance. This will be the world record once this finishes. So... And I sincerely doubt anyone is going to come up with an even better strategy than this. Execution of it? Sure. But better strategy, I would question whether that's even possible. I am. I'm so good I can be suboptimal and get the world record. <laughs> Certainly this will, like, compared to doing this the, the, the correct way, Tarkus, without using the uh, custom nation cheesy shenanigans that we have, you save, like, 150 years. You could maybe do some like ask for maps, 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 make us make a subject, do the whole giveaway core, get it back and get an adjacent bit of land and then get something way. That might just barely work, but that would probably take I can't see that taking less than forty years. And we've barely taken sixteen? It'll probably be like 18 by the time we're finished. Not even. 17. Uh, we want more cash on hand, so it's time to do some more exploiting. There's nothing more else to exploit, so the rest of this is going to be loans. What are the rules for the speedrun? Uh, because I'm going for no speed 5 as well as in game time, I'm not allowed to use speed 5. Other than that, nothing that the speedrun boards define as a exploit. Um, so things like fiddling with the start date before the game, before you start the game in order to change who has cause where. Um, that's about it. It's time to loan up to the hilt. We need 2,000 ducats. Uh, Speedrun leaderboards for each country. Uh, most of them are achievement based, Sophia. So this one is one of the uh, achievements that's built into the game. I already have it, so it won't appear in the list. Um, but start as Austria, get a province in Bengal. Uh, here, playing as Austria, no more than one custom nation exists. That nation can't have used more than 200 points. Have a TC in West Bengal, which we now do. And in that TC, build the District Trade Company, which I don't know what these are. Permanent Quarters, Local Quarters, Broker's Office, Broker's Exchange, Property Adjuster, Austrian Township, Austrian District? District Trade Company? Mm, don't know. We're going to have to find it. Admiralty. Company Depot. Well, the military one should be easy to see. We need Military Administration. Nah. Where is it? Broker. Broker. Property appraiser. I don't know these by hearts because I use them so very rarely. Mm. I use them so very rarely. District Trade Company. Investment and Military Administration Trade Company.
Ah. There's military administration. Done. And district trade company. I'm assuming that's this. We'll have a look through all the others. Company Depot, District Trade Company. I'm assuming that's that. Okay. And then we're done. Boop. None too hard. Crush the Rebellion. Next. What do we do next? What do we do next? What other ones that let you use CNs are there to do? There's the actual fun CN ones. We could go do Sweet Sweet Harmony. That's one that we could use the uh, CN to help us with. Because you could boost your harmonization speed. Have a look at that. 